Before you begin installation of the ornamental rail system, be sure you have all the components you will need. Rail and baluster kits are available for 6 foot and 8 foot sections. The rail kit conveniently includes material for one straight or stair rail section. Each baluster kit contains solid square balusters for one section and a 36 inch rail height. Post covers, post caps, and post skirts are sold separately. All the fasteners needed to install the railing are included in the rail kits. Inside the kit, you will find a template that will make mounting your brackets quick and simple. As always, TimberTech recommends consulting local building codes prior to installation. And be sure to consider deck lights before you install your railing. Whether you plan to install them now or later, modifications must be made to railing components to accommodate deck lights, wiring, and fixtures. View the deck lights installation video for more details. To start, install a treated 4x4 post at a maximum span of 8 feet center to center. Each post cover comes in 4 foot or 12 foot lengths and may need to be cut to the exact height. If irregularities in the lumber prevent an easy fit, you may need to plane the post before installing them on the deck. Slide a TimberTech post cover and post skirt over each of your 4x4 posts. Do not force the post covers onto the 4x4s. Next, center and mount one baluster to each post. Position the baluster 5 inches above the deck surface. Fasten baluster to the post using three 3.5 three inch color-coded screws. Fastener locations are 1.5 inch from each end of the baluster and one fastened in the center. Now we'll begin the railing assembly. Parts of TimberTech's ongoing railing enhancements include pre-drilled rails. The pre-drilled locations are 5 inches on center for a typical installation. If you need to customize the baluster spacing, TimberTech has a baluster spacing tool that will make customized pre-drilling quick and easy. Once you have finished pre-drilling top and bottom universal rails, attach the baluster to the universal rails to create the rail assembly using number 10 three and a half inch screws. Slide the finished railing assembly onto the post mounted balusters. Secure the rail assembly to the posts by driving number 10 three and a half inch flathead screws through the universal rail and into the post. Pre-drill a pilot hole at 30 degrees from horizontal and approximately 15 degrees to the side starting one and a quarter inches from the end of the rail. Use two screws at the upper universal rail and one at the outside of the lower universal rail. Attach the ornamental top rail to the rail assembly by fastening through the universal rail up into the ornamental rail. Fasteners should be located at every fourth baluster space. Support blocks are to be installed two feet on center fastened to the bottom universal rail and to the support blocks. To complete the railing, place TimberTech post caps over the posts and fasten them with finished nails or exterior caulk.